Once upon a time, there were three little pigs who went out into the world to build their homes and seek their futures. The first little pig did not like to work at all. He quickly built his house of straw because that was the easiest way. Then he danced off down the road to see how his brothers were getting along. The second little pig was building himself a house to he did not like to work either. So he decided to build his house out of sticks. That would be quick and easy soon. He was finished. The house made of sticks was not very strong, but at least his work was done. Now he was ready to play. What's, what the second little pig like to what the second little pig liked to do best was play the fiddle. The first little pig played the flute while his brother played the fiddle and danced. Then the two went off down the road to see about their brother. Brother, the third little pig was the serious one. He was building his house out of bricks. He did not mind working hard and he wanted his house to be strong. For he knew that in the woods nearby lived a big bad wolf who liked nothing better than to catch little pigs and eat them. So he worked and worked putting each and every brick carefully in place. The first two pigs laughed when they saw their brother hard at work, but the three little pigs just but the third little pig just ignored them and went about building his house. You can laugh and dance and sing. And call after his brothers, but I'll be safe and you'll be sorry when the wolf comes to your door. The first little pig had just reached his house and saw when the wolf coming knocking at his door. Little pig, little pig, let me come in, cried the wolf. Not by my hairy chin chin, said the pig. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and blow your house, roared the wolf. No. <laughs> oh, that one didn't fall down. Blow it down. Bam! And he did. Why he blew now? The little straw house <laughs> all to pieces. The poor little pig ran off to his brother's house made of sticks, but there was the wolf waiting for him. He knew that the pig would not let him in inside. So he decided himself as a sheep. Luckily, the pig could see through the wolf's you can fool us you can't fool us that sheep skin with that sheep skin cried the pig then i'll huff and i'll puff and blow your house away <laughs> in yelled the wolf and he blew the little house to twigs all to pieces the two pigs raced off to their brother's brick house. Don't worry, said the three, third little pig. You are safe here. Soon they were laughing and singing again. There, This made the wolf very angry. He huffed and he puffed and blew, puffed and puffed, but no matter 
how hard he tried, he could not blow down the little house of bricks. The wolf thought that and thought about how to get inside. Aha! Uh -huh. He could climb down the chimney and, and so he did right into a boiling kettle of water that pigs had hung in the fireplace. With a yell and a scream, the big bad wolf flew straight up the chimney and ran off into the woods. The three little pigs never saw him again. There, They were most con... con Content to sing and laugh and dance inside their brother's strong brick house. The end.